Oh, whoa! Had to come in through the ceiling. Is there a glass box here? Yeah. Oh, they put the glass box. They shut the glass oh. and I couldn't get in. I'm not gonna lie, I think I just broke both Tibbs and Fibs. I'm good, roll the intro! Tall guy, beard, twins, purple hoser. Dude, perfect in overtime. Tall guy, beard, twins, purple hoser. Now we're heading on to overtime. <laughs> Welcome to OT35. That is Renta y Cinco for our Spanish-speaking friends. Shout out to everybody in Ecuador watching. We love you guys. Got a great show coming up for y'all. Starting it off with a little Betcha, followed by Wheel, followed by Absurd Records. It is an absolute treat and a half. Wrapping it up with Cool Not Cool. Let's go to Betcha! All right, I bet you we, as a collective group, oh, wow. could break a wine glass with our voice. No chance. You're I, saying you think someone in the group is capable of doing it. I'm right? gonna say it is not doable. To break it with our voices. Our voices combined. It's a big difference. Like Captain Planet. I think it is totes doable. The final votes. Totes doable, yes. Yeah, it's happening. Totes not doable. Not doable. Oh, obviously I think I can do it. I pretended to bet you. Yeah. <laughs> votes are locked in. Let's go to the studio. Let's do it. Well guys, thanks for joining me at the recording studio. You bet. You guys ready to go break the glass? This is so cool. Hey, right. cheers. I might change my vote. Hey, I cheers. haven't decided yet. Cheers to a positive. I'll let you know. Come on. Let's do it. This can be done for the record. Sure. Yeah. sure. The question is, is it possible for us? The theory is that you match the pitch of the glass and the vibrations cause it to break. So you can put like a toothpick or a straw or something and when you match it, I'm about to go! Did you it, see it moving? It was getting, so we gotta match the pitch to break it. You're saying oh. that the glass is shaking, so the toothpick is shaking. I would've not voted yes. Yeah, I didn't know you got to use the toothpick. <laughs> Grab the glass and let's get started. Okay. Is that more? Is it high or low? Maybe it's, maybe it's low. Oh! Oh! Lost another betcha. Cheers to that, man. Hey, cheers to that. That was the world's fastest betcha we've ever had. My first glass break <laughs> with my voice. My first is if you're gonna do this hundreds of times. You are! <laughs> no. <laughs> Maybe just yell really loud at it. Uh, no, it's not it. I'm gonna start letting go up. We're done, we're done. We're trying to away from. Guys, yeah, you mean do another one? Give me, yes. give me that you little can't. one. Uh, Stop! No, 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 Cheers to you two. Thank hey, you. you did the work. Thank you did the work. Can we move on? No, let's not move on. Let's yeah. stay here. I don't want to go to wheel. It's time to yeah, move on. Time. Send it to wheelie. You know what, Codes? You send it to wheelie. Let's head to wheel! I'm kidding. They're not going to do it. They only do it when Gare does it. Gare, send them. It's real unfortunate Good time. send. Good send, send Gare. Good news. It's not a hat. Actually, you could say bad news. It's not a hat. Good news. <laughs> it's an air bazooka. Oh, oh, that could be fun. It that's, is going to be fun. That's it's random. And here's how it's going to work. Longest blasted name <gasps> I is like spinning it. the wheel. I like it. <laughs> I stress. I ah! will select the name ah! off the ground. Three, two, one, bazooka! Oh! 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 Hey, eliminate this guy. Yeah, eliminate. I'm eliminating him. Okay. This is going to be the safe person, but was almost not safe. Oh no, it's Cody. Get out of here, tall man. I can't yes! stand you right now. I am on a streak and a half. Bang! No! Which means the person spinning the wheel is Gary! There's one thing left to do. Go visit the guy I don't love to see, Ned Forrester. Go talk to him, see how he's doing. You know what? I'm gonna have fun with this one. Wow. I can't wait to see what that means. <laughs> oh, what is this, sparkling water? You know Ned only drinks still. Somebody take care of that. Ned Forrester, back in action. The one, the only, 
the great mastermind of this generation. It's so good to be back with you. That Jerry guy tried to sabotage the whole show. I'll be honest, I think you tried to kill me out on the ski slope. Took me down a double black diamond and said, who's he got double hottie smoke him? I don't know. He kind of says stuff that I'm not sure really what it means. Let's welcome Garrett Elbert. Proud to be here, Ned. Really? Yeah, I told the guys I was going to, you know, make it fun. No doubt. Yeah, I've always seen to... Corey. He just, he doesn't like this show. Sure. I know it sends a bad message to the kids. You know what I always say? Try to make the best of a That's motion. right. That's what? Make the best yeah. of a bad situation and your days will be brighter. That's even right. Even when you're sad. Oh. You know what? In honor of you being here and celebrate to hold this for me. Oh, gosh. I wanted to give you a couple coupons to the dead gift shop oh. downstairs. They've got a nice one Absolutely. set up. Absolutely. That'll get you a couple golden boys. Because you know Appreciate what? Appreciate that. It's a great day to celebrate. Oh, God. <laughs> you said you wanted to enjoy it. Oh, so I wanted to enjoy oh. it. <laughs> Today's my birthday. Oh, oh, oh. Happy birthday, Dad. You hold the pinata. I'll be oh. the bad guy. Oh. Hold it up, Dad. Oh. 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 Yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Go ahead. Anyways, while we're here, I might do it. Good spin, Gare. I'm not doing that. I struggle with claustrophobia. Oh, that's gonna be a doozy. <laughs> Come on in here with me. You said you're gonna enjoy it. I'm trying. My anxiety level. Let me see it on your face. I can't wait. <laughs> that's okay. unfortunate. No, no. <laughs> okay. I'm out of here. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, I am so proud to introduce Dr. Desai, orthopedic surgeon, here to help Why out. Why is Corey today. introing? Because uh, <laughs> I'm so glad I'm not the guy. He becomes obnoxious when he's not the guy. <laughs> he does. What's ailing you? Your whole upper? Yeah. My whole body's kind of hurt. Over, over, I, I, I think it's going to require a cast. Yeah, full. Yeah. Full. <laughs> yeah. Doctor, out of curiosity, how long do you think this is taking? Do you think we're going to have a chance to go catch a movie? Or what are, what are yeah, we thinking? Yeah, this should take somewhere between six and eight hours. So. <laughs> Well, on that note, yes. enjoy it, Gare. Oh. <laughs> Have you ever done a full body cast? No. <laughs> Every wrap, you lose a little bit more mobility. Moving on to the upper body should be great. Oh, no. All right. Fellas. Hey, don't touch me. I'm gonna feel anything. I've never been able to sign a chess cast, so I feel like I gotta take advantage. Really well done today. Let's give it up for the doctor. Uh, while the editors are signing, say it with me, Gare. That's unfortunate! Oh, Gare. Newly signed, freshly casted, the Purple Hoser! Good to have. Oh, thumbs up. He's good. Guys, he's good. He's giving us the thumbs up. It's like when they're wheeling a guy off the field. You always want to see that. So proud of you, buddy. <laughs> oh, man. That is rock solid. Well, we got a great segment coming up. Let's go to Absurd Recur! Yeah, I've got some bad news for you. Absurd recurs, we've got to go off-site. What? <laughs> yeah. Should have thought about that, but we couldn't. We didn't know you were going to get casted. So this is the most absurd recurred that you have ever heard. <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh. We're headed to the golf course! Oh, Gare, you gotta go with us. I'm not used to having it. It's gonna be a long day for you, buddy. Sparky here with Dude Perfect Records. I am the adjudicator today, and uh, Ty, you're gonna attempt a record that's never been done before, my man. Yes, sir, excited about it. World's longest putt using a foot-long hot dog. <laughs> uh, appreciate you being out here. Yeah. I don't know uh, how official uh, this actually is, but good to have somebody who looks sharp while we're doing this. Hey, I want you to focus, make it on the first try. You never know. I mean, these things take time, Gare. I'm gonna right, keep well, you off the green, because no greenskeeper wants to see that. Let's yeah. take you over there, Gare. Welcome, gentlemen. We're outside the lovely Omni PGA Frisco Resort, and we're here to break some records. A foot-long hot dog, longest putt. Frankly, some said it couldn't be done, yeah, but you're here to prove them wrong. Give it up, Ty Tony. Thank you. The man who uh, hopes to break the record today. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that. Thanks for being here, Spark. 57 feet, 2 inches, and I can confirm that would be good for a new world record if the putt is made. Hey, Ty, what brand are you using for your putter? Putter choice of the day, Sonic Uncooked Foot Long. <laughs> <laughs> Just, sorry, that was a bad attempt. Let me give let me let me give it another go. Yeah, yeah, it's got a real shot. It is a real wow. Come no, on, it's gotta go left. Come on, be the power. Go, left. go to your heart. Oh! Come on, Ty. Oh! 
You gotta be kidding me! I really like this, guys. I really like this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Talk to me, yeah, dude. Well done. <laughs> It is. We'll be auctioning off this ball. It's going to be awesome. You guys are going to want to hold on to this one. Thank you. Tyler, congratulations on behalf of me and everybody at Dude Perfect Records. The world's longest putt using a foot long hot dog. Thank you. You are now the record holder. Congratulations, sir. It's unofficial, but it was perfect. Thank you. Yes, Thank you, Sparky. What an honor. Back to the desk. Thank you. Please, all the applause. This will go down as one of the greatest achievements of my life. I've had some great records, but nothing will ever come close to this. My first ever game be up. They're trying to shut me off. Thank you. So I'd just like to thank uh, all my friends. Adjudicator Sparky. Okay, got it. Thank you guys. Well, boy, what an accomplishment. And that leaves us with one segment left. I'm having such a great time. I think we should do another four segments. Yeah. Too many. Let's just go to the last segment. It's time for Cool Not Cool! It's time for Cool Not Cool, and I gotta tell you guys, bring the music down, Chad. My item's not very good today. What? I'm kidding, it's great. I was excited. I was gonna I'm set like... expectations, and people are gonna be like, oh, I can't believe you got those. Where did he find them? I want them. <laughs> Anyways, who wants to go first? I can go first. Mine's a really old item. Oldest right. item to date on Cool Not Cool ever. Really? Yeah. I don't understand. Hey, guys. Yeah. Would it be too hard to request me being able to see the items being presented? No, no, it's not, no. How's that? Yeah, I love that. Okay, great. <laughs> Coach, go ahead, All continue right. on. Favorite field trip growing up was when you got to go to the Alamo for fossils. Oh, yeah. Gary's kind of fossilized today. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. Well, you know what else is fossilized, Kobe? What? T-Rex poop. Check that out. We actually don't know the species. It could be a long neck, it could be a T-Rex, no, it could be a right in No way. Yeah, no, no, for real. This is real. We got to borrow it from a museum. <laughs> oh, what? How do, I mean, I don't own the dino. You borrowed a cool not cool item? You know what is yours? A rock? No, that's petrified poo, my friend. <laughs> You're joking. No, it really is. <laughs> You're joking. No, that's dinosaur what do dome. What you mean? What does it smell? How do it's you know? It's a megalodon. There's something you should know about both Corey and myself. We don't like potty humor. No, it's it just not doesn't. Potty to humor. me, it's not funny. Uh, it's not hey, interesting. This about basic it. Dinosaur rock. Dome? Talk to me in this I don't hand. like touching it. I'm gonna let you move this. <laughs> oh! I think you just redded yourself. <laughs> it doesn't even smell. Can I open this a little bit? Dump? This thing is sealed. I have an idea. What? Break it with your voice. <laughs> I'll try it. Try I'll try it. But if that doesn't work, we're going to break it with a rock. And if we can catch a whiff of anything, yeah. as soon as it comes out, yeah. which there should be it some should be. smell. There should be. Then I'll give it a green, just to prove that it's a dino dump. <laughs> I'm not joking with you. The dump is vibrating. You got to be ready to smell, because this is going to be quick. Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. No, not real. That is the fe that is okay. a live oak branch that yes. got fossilized. They're like, looks like a dino dump to me. Super not cool. Bogus. Get that weak stuff out of here. Here, here, get rid of that. I'm gonna keep oh. this. Oh. This is right off. That was riveting. <laughs> Thank you, my good sir. I agree. Who's next? <laughs> you want to present to us? Sure. Help with my item, please. Here's the deal. What I have in my hand is a candy. 3D printer, Prince Candy. Hey, would you call this a food item? This is a food item. Okay. Wow. Yes. Does it dry and become like a Jolly Rancher? Yes, it's a Jolly Rancher. All right, show me and I'm in. Is this, is it working right now? It's a slow goer, guys. We could capture some more dino dump and let it fossilize at this rate. I'm gonna draw a heart for you guys, because that's about all I can draw. Yeah, I mean, you are doing it. I don't think you're gonna finish the heart. If you oh, finish you the heart, it? I'll give you a green. Oh, okay. I'm not gonna lie to you, this is, this is tough. When you're in a full body cast, you pick up stuff like crochet and candy making. <laughs> Let me see it! <laughs> I haven't seen it yet. That looks like a heart. <laughs> I can't believe I greened that. It looks like my heart right now. Taste it, taste it. It's like the consistency of a melted jolly. Taste Dude, it. I love all candy, so if this is bad, it's all getting red. Come on. 
Come on. Oh, I'm, I'm in. not gonna lie to you. I'm in. It tastes very good. Yeah. Dude, look out! Hey, bad artwork, great flavor. Hey, Gary, I gotta be honest. I gotta keep the integrity of the show. I do not think that meat. genuinely that deserves a super cool. I can't do it. That. I can't do it. Corey, a simple no would have sufficed next time. <laughs> no. Okay. I'll go okay. next. My item's back here. Just give me a second. Great. If Garrett were an item, I would green the heck out. Yeah. I think everybody knows one of the most iconic sayings in all marketing. Once you pop, you just can't stop. Not just appealing for Pringles. That's, that's not the saying. It's not the it's saying. It's not the saying. If you're gonna call out one slogan, yeah. get it right. Once you pop, the fun don't stop. That's like Sparky saying, uh, that ain't for me, dog. That's not for me, dog. Randy Jackson has one memorable quote. Don't mess it up. That's a no for me, dog. Yeah. Once you pop, the fun don't stop. Is the quote you were looking the for. The greatest clothing item in the history of attire, the bubble wrap hoodie. Oh my goodness gracious <laughs> sakes alive. It's full body. You literally can spend hours popping bubble wrap. How many times are we gonna let him bring the worst possible item we have ever seen? Give yourself a little pop and enjoy it. But then it's over. Eventually these do run out, but until they do, you're having yourself a day. Somebody shut his mic off! Toby! Call me when he's done. And I will take the time to lay around on the ground as my brother recommended, and it will make the noises you've all dreamed up. That didn't work. <laughs> Here's my vote, guys. Hey, I gotta protect the super not cool. I love it. Will somebody red mine for me? <laughs> Who's next? Would you like to redeem the group or me? You know what? Nobody's ever called me TT to Redeemer, and I don't think it's a very good name for me, so why don't you go ahead? <laughs> okay. This thing's yeah. pretty toasty if you can hurry. Excuse me. Sorry. We got a guy in a full body cast over here, <laughs> and Bubble Wrap Poncho Boy is complaining after going for 15 minutes. Oh. Give me a break. Even 15. Even a it's been one minute. Oh. I think it's important to set proper expectations before you put out your item. Agreed. Okay. My item is extremely. Yes. Fun for children. Every kid that I have ever met loves bubbles. And so far, this is what most kids have to work with. Fairly typical Please tell me that's not your item. Maker. This is not my item. Fellas, I've taken the liberty of giving each one of you guys one of my- Show us your item! Please look <laughs> under your chair what? and you will see the item because you each have one. Dudes, all at the same time, I present to the world the bubble gun! Oh, wow. I know, it's hard to see me! Oh. Reload! Oh, wow! Our bubbles will blot out the sun! <laughs> well, then we'll bubble in the shade! <laughs> Tell me your toddler would not have an absolute no. blast oh, with that. That is gorgeous. Right at Garrett! Right at Garrett! Woo! Shockingly more fun than I would have imagined. Look at how many they are. I can't reach my green button. I got you, brother. Put it in my hand. Oh, wow. That's a green for me. That's a good item. It's a green for me. Go, oh, Joe. It's up to me. All right, I like it. Green! Hey! Wow! Can I go? Yeah, you may. Sure. Okay, here's the deal, guys. You know that I am partial to one type of footwear. Crocs. Boots. Well, boots and Crocs. Boots two types Crocs. of footwear. And that is exactly what I have brought today. Brought a freshy pair of white Crocs today. At first glance, you might think, wow, those look nice. That would be appropriate for you, Ty. But these have got a special little gadget. Okay. Let me show you. You simply walk out here, you set them down, you're gonna want four-wheel drive mode for these. I think I know what those are. You do? You are not about to tap dance. <laughs> no, you're right, oh, you're God. right, I'm not. I'm not about to tap dance. But what I am about to do <laughs> is fall. Ladies and gentlemen. He's gonna pretend like he didn't do that live. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time, I proudly present to you. Thank you. Oh, Thank first you. try. Thank you. Thank if you, me too. If you're not careful, you're gonna end up in a full body cast like me, brother. Ty, give oh, me my green. Oh, gosh. I'm good. No, you really could do like a little. Cloggy. Cloggy. <laughs> not terrible. <laughs> Corey, hit your green. No, this is for you. Nice. This is now also for me. Sorry. I, I am killing the game healings. now. I'm a Healy wizard. Watch yeah. this. We're gonna see, I'm gonna judge based on this performance. That's good. Just like my bubble suit, that's a green. Green for you, green for me. Oh, yeah! Super cool! Thank you guys. 
Tell them what we're doing uh, coming up on the high seas. So. Yeah, we're going on a cruise. Yeah. We're hosting a cruise. We're leaving out of Florida. We're going on a big boat all together, us. And it's going to be fun. That's a positive. Yeah. And we're going to have special guests with us. Yeah. T Swift. <laughs> I'm kidding. She's not confirmed. But if she does show up because she's a fan, what a world that would be. Huh? T Swift, Adam Sandler, Tom Brady, any of those people could show up at any time. I'm not ruling it out as a possibility. So come join us on the cruise. It's going to be awesome. You guys are definitely going to want to come because we're going to the Bahamas. Yes. And it's incredible. On a real cruise ship with lots of fun things. With a captain do. driving, not us. The water looks like. Gatorade Icy Blue. It is gorgeous. Just sign up to come and you go to dudeperfectcruise.com. Yeah, yeah, we're going to keep talking about the cruise. I'll help him. Okay. While we're on the topic of promos, Thursday night football. Believe it or not, you're looking at a couple of analysts. Yes. No, NFL broadcasters. Broadcasters. Yes. Even worse. I always get the term confused. Yeah, Thursday night football's uh, on Amazon. Thursday night football's alternate broadcast, which they say is the one you want to be on. Go to Prime Video. You'll see it right there on the broadcast. Chargers versus Chiefs. Dude, Perfect. Come join us live from the DPHQ2 in Frisco. Signing off for now. Pound it. Noggin. Somebody better go check on Gary. I'm going. <laughs>